Hi guys, Mike Day here with EverythingAboutConcrete.com. In this video, we're going to show you how we finish a concrete pool deck with a broom finish. And specifically, how we cut in the grooves, how we do the broom finish, and then how we leave the finished edge or tool mark around the outside. So the first thing we do is we got to mark out where the grooves are going or where the joints are going around the pool deck. Now this is a, about a four foot wide pool we have here. So we're going to go about every four to five to maybe six feet wide around this pool and, and make sure we have plenty of joints in there. And these joints aren't just for aesthetic looks, they're to help control any cracks in the concrete also. So we've done quite a few of them already here as you can see. Those are, that's our concrete, that's the concrete joiner tool right there. Some people call it a joiner, some people call it a groover. So what we do is we get it marked out. You can see the mark I have there. We offset the straight edge a little bit so it'll line up with our groover. And then we tap this groover into the surface. The concrete's still pretty soft. This is probably 30 or 40 minutes after we got done pouring the concrete. I can push my finger down in there, you know, maybe a quarter, three-eighths of an inch. You don't want to wait till it's too hard or you'll never get these joints in. So we tap the surface of the concrete with that groover right there and that pushes down the rocks and it brings up the cream and it leaves you that nice smooth looking joint right there and if there's any imperfections in this as you're doing it if there's any big rock holes you can use use a little bit of paste from the surface like right there and fill that in with the paste and then you can just run the groover over it and it'll smooth it right out there you can see you got that groove cut and that didn't take very long to do that once you get the hang of it it's pretty easy to do so you're just gonna go all the way around the pool and get all your joints cut in first and then once you get all your joints cut in then you're gonna start mag floating out the surface and getting ready to broom it now if the sun's out you're gonna have to be you're gonna be working pretty quick here Today was about 70 degrees and it was partly cloudy, so we didn't have to work too fast on this. So we got the surface all magged out. Now we're just pulling that broom over it nice and slow and even so those lines are really straight. And then once we get all these brooms, once we get all the broom mark done, then we'll put the finished groove red, the finished groove tool mark in, and then we'll also do the finished edge around this edge here. You can see I got a guy over there magging the surface, one guy brooming, and then now we're putting in the finished groove mark here. And you want to be pretty fussy with this. This is what the finished product's going to look like. It's going to look like each square has a kind of like a picture frame look to it. And there it is, nice and smooth. And we'll go around, we'll finish two things, putting in all our grooves. And then finish magging it, finish brooming it, finish grooving it. And then we'll put in the finished edge of mark and we'll be all done. So this is kind of kind of fussy work, guys, if you want it to look really nice. You gotta be real fussy with this. You don't want any stop and start marks. You just want a nice smooth looking groove, a nice smooth looking broom mark here. You don't want to stop and start with the broom either. You want to pull it from one end to the other without stopping. That's what makes these pool decks look really nice when you're done. We usually have one guy do one thing. One guy do the grooving, one guy do the brooming, one guy do the edging. Even though, even though one guy could do it all, it just makes things go a lot smoother. There you can see there's the finished edge mark along with the finish groove mark and the broom mark and that's it guys once we have it at this point that's done then we leave it and let it dry overnight usually and then we'll come back and strip the forms off well that's it guys if uh, if you like these kind of videos go ahead and hit the like button also hit the subscribe button while you're down there and the little bell notifications you'll be updated with all my upcoming videos and leave a comment if this is the type of broom finish you'd like around your pool or if you'd like some other type of finish, you know, let me know and I'll make a video on that too. Thanks a lot, guys.